doing i hope you're all doing okay thank you so much for always supporting thank you for showing up and thank you for always being patient with me you all are amazing now if you're new here my name is miss rombo and together as a family we are the race squad so to join the race squad it's very simple all you have to do is tap on that subscribe button and while at it don't forget to turn on the notification bell beside the subscribe button in order to be alarmed anytime i upload a video so today I'm here with a very much awaited video of my new house and um, guys you all know how much I'm in love with this house I'm so happy here anyway that is not the point the point is you guys want a house tour my discord on the power working is what is the house tour so ideally I wanted to do just one house tour uh, that meant that I had to do everything else that I wanted to do in this place from decor, furnishing and all that well I wasn't going to do it uh, immediately so it would have taken a while but you guys said that I do one before transformation and then I can do the other one after the transformation which I don't think I have a problem with that so that is why we are here with this video Welcome you all to my house where there is we spread so much kindness, we spread so much love and happiness. If you're here for some negativity, well I'm gonna kick you out. <laughs> I'm kidding anyway, just try and be kind to everyone because uh that way we make a very beautiful world for everyone. Okay, so without wasting much of your time, let's tour the house. <laughs> Welcome to the risk world. So I'm standing right by the door and of course for you to come into the house I have to open the door from, from this place or this place depending on Malini Melokia Mlangu. Okay, I am mentioning things that I'm not supposed to mention because last time to, <laughs> a few people in Ambia Tisiku Fana detailed Nina Dinili watch and Shadow up on Jijazi. Well, I'm sorry if uh, that was the case. Today I'm going to do a detail. <laughs> okay, so of course uh, you will meet this curtain after the door, and uh, this one place that I don't like because uh, the way the curtain rods are designed imagine in just some space here that someone can just peep but let me know how i can just walk around this because uh, this is not even pleasing anyway that's just a small detail so we can survive we can survive <laughs> perfect so next after the curtains obviously uh, you will step on a doormat and it's a doormat that you are all familiar with if you have watched my other house tour. Of course, if you're new here, uh, I, ha I just moved into this house recently. And I did the house tour of the house that I moved out from. So I'll just link it right here, somewhere right there. Go watch it and then you can catch up with us. Okay, so we were on the doormat and... Uh, this is that tomat that I love so much. I found it at Tuskies uh, at 200 bob. It says always be kind. And you all know that I love communicating that. Always be kind to people. It makes what this world a better place. <laughs> okay, so when you're standing from the door, we we'll start from the left, the right side. This is my right side. So no, we we'll start from the right side. So on the right side is where I've decided to put all my shoes. Not all my shoes, some of my shoes, uh, this is where I decided to place the shoe rack. So there will be nothing changing in this area because I will have nowhere else to put the shoes. That makes sense. <laughs> anyway, so this is the shoe rack and um, it's working just fine and I love it so much. So when you come off the shoes area, uh, 
of course you will walk into the kitchen area and actually this is the first thing that you see because the kitchen is just directly opposite the main door okay so guys i am not going to give you guys a house uh sorry a kitchen tour because there is a very detailed kitchen tour of this kitchen in this channel so i will just link it here and also i will link it in the description box so that you can just watch it with so much ease but i will just show you an overview of uh, just in case anything has changed and uh, let you know what i'm planning to do with what and you know all that kind of stuff okay so oh this is just food that i got from home and then this is the dining area and uh, the only thing i'm planning to do with this space is just uh spray paint this furniture it's actually something that was suggested to me by one of you just to make it a little bit glammed up and aesthetic, you know, and spooky to Gaio. <laughs> this is just the cooking area, the sink area, storage area, more storage, you know. So the only thing that has changed in this kitchen is uh, added a curtain, which to me, I don't think is such a good idea because this is a very tiny kitchen. So it has blocked a little bit of lighting but I think I need all the light in this kitchen. So I think I'm just going to remove the curtain all together to in a nyonya light. <laughs> in a nyonya light. <laughs> okay, so uh, this is uh, meant to be the pantry organization area, but this is what I have done with this space. So guys, that is it for the kitchen. I don't plan to do much with the kitchen because I love it the way it is. So from here now we're going to walk back to the main door and just uh, move to the left side of the room which is meant to be the main room. Okay, so and we just so come with me. <laughs> yes, so now I'm at the main door and I, now I can allow you to have a glimpse of my main room which uh, I think I'm going to give you a tour starting from this wall over here as I walk you round Daddy Harper. <laughs> so yeah, as I take you through the arrangement as for now, I will also tell you um, the plans I have for this space so that eventually when I upload the transformation video, you will know which plan failed and uh, which one <laughs> was a success. So yeah, so as I said, I want to start from this wall and with this wall, what I plan to do is, uh, okay, let me show you the situation right now. Uh, right now, it's just a plain wall and uh, right above there, I have uh, some artwork going on. Uh, these are arts that my parents have had to do for how many years and they were not using it anymore. So I decided to hammer with them and the beauty is, uh, like read that one it says people are lonely because they build walls instead of bridges which is so much very true and then the other one says freedom is the right to be wrong not the right to do wrong so yeah so what i plan to do with <laughs> this wall is right down here i plan on having a console if cj sem are wrong it's a console Cindy. <laughs> Then right above the console, I plan on having a very huge artwork going on. It's actually a painting, a drawing, sort of. And uh, someone is already working on it, and I just can't wait to get my hands on them. Okay, so that is it for this wall. But as for now, now I have these seats over here. They're just two plastic chairs. They may beat. <laughs> So with these seeds, I plan on um, spray painting them so that the kue supu. Sinaniya bisha, but voila! So when you come off that area, we move into this area, which is uh, the entertainment area. And still act as a little bit of storage. So right here, I have my laptop and it's playing some music. Yay! Yay! <laughs> okay, and then my hoofah, and then let's talk about the table. So right here, I have 
this box my box here simu this is just where i put all my one bob coins and other foreign money that obviously collect then right here i have my sanitizer and then my power bank and my five bobs which are for use so on this other side i have uh, just flash disks and uh, memory card holders that i use on my woofer yeah and a wallet there which i don't know near boyfriend Mugani. then right down there is where i put my speakers and then he nile nini asimu at asimu sorry kuweka nini i love to put it somewhere where i can see it then down here i have all my sunglasses and then right there i have my besties makeup uh, bag and then these two bags also uh they were part of they were part of uh, the bags that i walked you through if you haven't checked that video yet please do go check it out my 2019 handbag collection anyway uh from there i have uh my cabinet area going on and um as you can see it divides the space somehow but before that down here i have a picture of me and my bestie and then a very ugly candle holder <laughs> i got from home the right here is where i put all my hair stuff hair things going hair hair i need to to number 10 and i knew it so yeah that's it okay so where were we we were here right here and this is the overview of the place uh yes that is my entertainment area nothing fancy nothing going on just have some dirty shoes over there something i forgot to mention anyway so from this area which uh this acts as a divider somehow so on this other side is my closet area <laughs> most of you na kufia sana closet yangu and it's something that i won't walk you through in details because there is a video that will come your way because a lot of you want to know a lot about closet organization okay so up there i have curtains that i used while i was moving houses and then just right here i have boxes that carry my receipts especially for products that have warranty and then this is just my travel bag and then right here i have my air freshener which smells so great guys <laughs> then right here i have this gadget which i also use when i'm shooting yeah so that is what is going on down here my bags more shoes down there and then right here i have all my watches which <laughs> <laughs> for some reason they stopped at the same time <laughs> fake things fake things anyway up there i have a place where i can hang my clothes but i haven't bought any hangers yet i told you guys i haven't shopped at a... okay so the right at the corner i have these two cartons so the carton down below here is what is carrying clothes that i will have to hang over there and then this is just carrying all my inner wares and then a mirror here which i haven't figured out where i'm gonna hang it so it's just resting there then i have more books my mood swing bag and then my barracoas <laughs> then i have this baby chair which holds my towel at the moment uh, till i find what i'm gonna do with it then right here i have these bags which are homeless <laughs> They haven't found a place yet so that's where they are on this coffee table yes and this coffee table also acts as a sitting area and it's my favorite spot especially in the morning you know it's by the window and there in the morning there is so much fresh air coming in i'm just always seated there and you know doing my thing <laughs> yeah i love how this corner turned out okay so when you come off this area okay sorry chinia this uh this is just a coffee table in case you're wondering just down there i have more storage at least uh so someone who didn't know what's down there yeah then i have more shoes down there 
my beautiful shoes and then kando yake now i have this tool which is a uh, baby zwahawa coffee table <laughs> And it's carrying my mirror at the moment. I haven't figured out where I want the mirror yet. Once I do, I will hang it. Okay, so uh, right here on this tool, I have this box that carries uh, my brass traps. And just something I use to shave. And then a condom over there. And then a towel that I use uh, once in a while. And then a mirror, just in case I need a mirror in the bathroom. Yes, so from this pot over here, uh, down there, I have bathroom slippers and a very dirty rug. Just assume <laughs> you walk into the bathroom and uh, that is what is going on. So I haven't bought a bulb yet. I need to buy a bulb. So at the moment, I'm using this lighting over here, which is something that I bought just in case to my potter. And also it comes in handy anytime I'm shooting and there is not enough lighting. Okay, then I have that air freshener uh, which has a rose scent. So amazing. Yes, then right there I have my shower kit. And then I put chini, kuna, you know, pills that I used to fua. And then, hey, ndio kisuguli yo changu. See, you guys wanted a detail. Tu wamina nitesa. Anyway, so when you come off that area, that area, so we move into the beauty area. This also is one of the places I love how much it came through for me. So let's start with Apoju, uh, where I'm, this hanging shelf, by the way, I made it myself. I will just leave a link right here somewhere there <laughs> so that you can go watch it it used to be in my kitchen but now it has found a home right there and it's carrying uh my bags then uh, right here i have the sink uh, that i use in it on any wash and basin yes then i have my paracord that i'm using at the moment and then a mirror again that i haven't figured out um where I'm gonna hang it. Then down here I have all my dirty clothes. <laughs> right there I have the scoop. And then yeah. So next here I have my mirror. Again, I haven't really figured out how I'm going to hang it. So for now it's being bebored by the measure. <laughs> so right here I have uh, this container that carries my toothbrush and everything meno. I will find a way of hanging it on the wall. Okay, then guess this is just my beauty area. Things that come through for me anytime I want to be glammed up. Uh, but if you guys want an extensi extensive tour on this, let me know in the comment section. But that is what's up in that corner. <laughs> so when you come off that corner, Yes, we move to the window, which is very bare. I haven't shopped for curtains. I haven't shopped for anything in this house. Every single thing you're seeing is something that I moved out of from the other house. I haven't done anything shopping. I just want to sit down and make um, a list, then uh, go window shopping and then <laughs> come back and make a budget. And then I can just shop in peace. Okay, so right here, I have this carton. It's actually a carton, by the way, guys. It's a carton. And um, just use this Maasai Shuka just to bring it together. And then this acts as now as my side table. You know, so I have some books going on right there. A notebook, you know, and uh, some pens over here this is just a container a styling gel i love it so much i do want to you know a mirror there it's broken but you know, my bluetooth speaker i don't know i've been trying to window shop for <laughs> phones i want to buy a new phone guys let me know which phone i should buy so from there now i have my bed uh, which I love how it has turned out. It's such a comfortable bed. Uh, but so what I plan to do with the bed is I'm going to to paint it. Sorry, spray paint it. I'm going to paint it white. 
so that it just brings a little bit of aesthetic in the room and then for my bedroom everything else is gonna change i'm gonna have white and uh, pink going on on the bed yes so right here i have my pink so the pink i want on my bed are this pink so that they matchy matchy with everything but right there i just have a rug and you know yeah so that's it for my house guys and this is just the overview when you're standing at the door <laughs> yes Just hold the door and then you come all the way to this place. Yes, yes, yes. Perfect. <laughs> so guys, we have just come to the end of this video. And if you love my space as much as I do, please give this video a big thumbs up nipple likes nipple likes and thank you so much for the love that you guys have shown me in my other house tour you guys are so amazing so before i forget i didn't tell you the plans i have for this wall so this wall right here that is beside my bed is going to be my accent wall so i'm going to use a wallpaper right over there so the theme of my house will be blue <laughs> Uh, the theme of my house will be blue, grey, a touch of gold and some pink and white. <laughs> so much color going on, right? You just wait until you see me bring this to life. Okay, if this video is too long or is so long, I'm so sorry. It's because uh, a few of you asked for me to do it in a detailed form. Nani may come through na your detail. I hope I have met your expectations. Yes. So guys, if you haven't subscribed to this channel, please do subscribe. We are a family full of positivity. We love life. We spread so much kindness happiness and love in this channel there is absolutely no reason for you not to subscribe to this channel so please do subscribe <laughs> thank you also let me know in the comment section what you think about this face so far what you think i can do with this face because also your opinion matters we are a family so i'd love to know your thoughts on what i can do with this face uh, maybe there is something i'm not seeing yes and i guess i will leave you guys at this point with the usual quote be kind to people it will cost you nothing to be kind to spread some love and happiness into someone else's houses or someone else's life will make this world a better place just by being nice yes try it it's so good for your health too yes i guess at this point i'm just going to log off and give and tell you guys Bye bye and see you in my next video which will be a story time of why I was kicked out and it's a video that is also so so much requested by the risk squad and <laughs> I want to know why I was kicked out so stay tuned for that. Till then. <laughs> <laughs>